We'll see. So, the plan is... Someone in the YouTube comments gave us a really good idea. Um, it was actually about the bricks. They said that they've seen some old buildings where they put perspex, you know, over a part of the wall or something. So you can still see it, but you can't get all the mess, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then that got us thinking the other night about behind here. Because we were going to leave this plasterboarded because it goes back a bit and that's the back of the chimney. So it's all covered in soot. And black, so we didn't really want it no. exposed. No, because it, yeah, it's not the prettiest. <laughs> but there is an, there is the old hole where the bread oven used to be. I can't remember exactly where it is. Hopefully, it'd be above where the oh, I hope so. Kitchen cupboards are. So what we could do is expose it, clean it off, and put perspex over it, so you can still see it, but you're not getting all the horrible yeah, yeah, yeah. stuff. You know? And and with the lights as well. Yeah, and then maybe put some lights lights up here to illuminate it. I think that'd look it's fantastic. Been, it's been that long now, I can't even remember what it looked like. I just remember it was horrible and we needed to cover yeah, it up because it, it was black. But so, then to be fair, we were in a totally different mindset back then too. Yeah. Like, <laughs> total rabbit in headlights. So I think I'm going to rip. Pull this out and just see what it's like and see... See where the features are, and then if it works out, we can maybe do something with it. Come on, then, let's do this. <laughs> Watch out, Buzz. I think Buzz wants to help. Obviously, we insulated behind here pretty well because this is where the log burner was. So. Oh, what's in that? I, can't remember I, can't, we left I don't there. know. Oh, weren't we? We were going to use that for wood, maybe. Oh my goodness! Look, I remember now the the little triangle bit. See the old, the old arch of where the bread oven used to be, and obviously it's been bricked up at some point. So that's kind What's, of. Have you got the tape measure handy? Let's see. Well, that's the main feature that we want to be revealed, isn't it? It'd be lovely for all this to be revealed. Oh, I know. Behind the... the cooker. And just come to about there. Definitely, that is definitely we need to. I think it's still worth it, isn't it? So how can we clean the black off? Would that could that be sandblasted? Is that a thing? Well, that's what I'm thinking. Now we've got this guy coming round. Um, I could maybe ask him if he can just sandblast this top half. I don't know how well all this would come off. But hundreds of years of smoke pouring out. Up into the chimney, isn't it? That's really satisfying you doing that. That is just so fabulous. Yeah, I mean, even... Yeah, 
yeah, we could even see that's a spray foam that we put in there because there was so many drafts coming. Well, through. there was so much leaking of heat though, wasn't there? Um, even maybe try put a door. You know the old doors that you we can pick one the of them up in a brocante, yeah. Like the cast iron doors, just for aesthetics or something. Oh my goodness, I love it. Yeah, obviously that's all just. Caked on. No, well I can ask him if he can sandblast it. If not, maybe we could just clean up the bricks. You know, and leave that and then a bit of perspex. Or could we maybe do it as glass? Because obviously we need a, a splashback of some sort, don't we, there, for, for oven. Yeah. Yeah, I think we can do something with that, can't we? Well, oh, 100%. So here, here would have been where they kept the coal or wood or whatever. That would have been where they load it. And they probably wouldn't have had a door. I think they'd have just heated it up and all the smoke would have poured out and gone straight up the chimney. But there was, wasn't there? There was a, a an attachment of bricks or... I don't know how you got like a dome on the back of the wall on the other side, wasn't there? Yeah, which isn't there anymore. Really no. So that, that would have led through to a little dome on the back and that would have been the oven. And everyone in the little all, village all came. All this would have just been full of wood, bread, upstairs of the bean where they kept all the flour sacks and stuff like yeah. that. You know what it would be cool? I've just thought. Hmm. Go down the mill, mm -hmm. down the road. Yeah. Because that's probably been here as long as this. Yeah. So they probably milled the local flour down at the mill and they would have brought it up here to make the bread. Oh, my... We could see yeah. if they've got any old sacks or anything. Oh, that would be amazing. Actually, that would literally be amazing. And we could hang because it up. All, all the local mills or people who used to God. produce the flour used to have their own God. sacks. God. So they're all Hessian sacks, but mm -hmm. they'll have had either a certain pattern or their name on it or something like that. Just to, So when they sent the flower out and they came back, you knew we could bring it back to you. Yeah. What do you think we should do, Thomas? You can do some hammering. <laughs> you can do some hammering. Are you going to knock some more wood out? I think you're a bit too small yet. Yeah. <laughs> Jack, where are we going? School. We're on the way to school. Jack, it's the first day of school. It's the first day of school. Are you excited? What's up, baby? What? Yeah. Hey, bye. Ah. You're right. So here are the guys getting prepared and ready for the sandblasting. <laughs> so what what is this equipment that you're getting out using? This is just a sandblasting hose. It's this is really what the big. sand comes down to clean all the walls with. Oh, fantastic. So I'll just stretch it up. And then you've got the big trailer on the back, I'm assuming, is that the... Compressor for the air. Oh my goodness, it's massive. And what are they used see, for? It's very dusty. <laughs> yeah, it's massively dusty. What would you say? What are these big fans used for usually? Just to try and get rid of the dust because you won't be able to see anything. Oh, well, no, I suppose. And you will need to cover that room 
that hallway between your house or your house is going to fill up the sand as well. Oh, crikey, really? Right, better crack on with that then. Wow, yeah, there's dust everywhere. Take the kids out of the house. Okay, really? Yeah, seriously. Nasty stuff, actually, the dust. Take the kids down to the pigs. <laughs> Feed them to them. <laughs> yeah. Okay, no worries. I get all the animals and whatnot out of the house and children. Oh, this is a beast, isn't it? This is a beast. Do you want some earplugs? <laughs> is it, is it going to be that loud? No, it's not noisy at all. <laughs> I just put the earplugs in to keep my ears warm. Yeah, it's for effect. Da 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 da. Scare the kids though. Oh. <laughs> How are you doing? I bet you're roasting hot, aren't you? I don't have to hear you, it's not your thing too. Oh, oh yeah. Wowzers! That is such nasty stuff coming out. So, you're all packing up? Yes, how, another job finished. I know, how do you feel it went in there? Oh, okay, it's a bit of a, bit of a, a lot of dust to settle, but uh, once the beans are oiled or waxed, yeah, that's our plan. We're going to use the um, the Osmo oil or Osmo wax. So it's the to finish them off. But yeah, get them done as soon as possible to stop all the crap going back in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then de-dust. And de-dust, yeah. De-dust. Yes. Well, thank you very much. Oh, it's a pleasure. Yeah, definitely, definitely will do. Oh, hi, my boy. Hey. Did you have a good day at school? Did you have a good day? Huh? Did you have a good day? Do you make lots of friends? A lot of friends. A lot of friends. Oh, good boy. Be prepared to be amazed. Wow. That is a big difference, isn't it? I was going to say, what do you think? Massive difference.
looks amazing, doesn't it? Cool. I'm chuffed with that. And me too. Looks so different, doesn't they? So much lighter now as well. Yeah, it's really made a difference in her. Yeah. But look at the fireplace, though. I oh, honestly... Yeah, I see that. Look at how fantastic that's come up. I know Matthew who said that it's what would have dried onto the, the stone almost almost dries like a rock. So it's, you know, it, he didn't know how good it would come out. But actually, I think that is absolutely fantastic. Yeah. Yeah, it looks good. It's got rid of all that sort of years of burnt on stuff anyway, isn't it? You can see the stones now. I know, but it's it's still got character though. It's still got, yeah. you know, the... That's cool, yeah. I'm almost thinking, knock that out. What, all the way through? Well, yeah, obviously that had been a hole originally. It's just been bricked up by someone, but I don't know, have a think. It's good though, isn't it? Some bit so big. <laughs> A bit worse off than we thought, aren't they? Yeah. Now they've been sort of sanded back. I think a bit of the um, <laughs> the black was holding it together a bit more than. Yeah. It's still nice to see. You can see, which you couldn't see these before, the pegged joints. Well, it looks on honestly, it looks amazing. They did such a good job. Just a lot of mess now. Oh. I know. So we also had a burst water pipe at the same time. So, <laughs> to be honest, it'll make it, getting the sand up a little bit easier. I know, really, actually, it, it, it did it did kill the dust a bit more. No, it looks great. I'm chuffed with that fireplace, especially above as well. I mean, he's done the bricks as well, has he? Uh, he must have dusted over them because they look really... Possibly. It looks all nice and clean now. Possibly, but, you know, he worked, really worked hard on that area. Yeah, these were all nice. See all these... All the joints here now, which you couldn't see yeah. before. Some old nails that we need to take out. But yeah. Do you know what? I literally, I cannot wait to just oil these and keep them as they are. Yeah, well, we need to get some treatment on them ASAP, probably this yeah. weekend. And Definitely. then the oil after that once that's soaked in. I guess there's a little bit of woodworm, which we couldn't see before, but nothing. They're still... They're still really solid, so... Yeah, definitely. Highly recommended. Good. Chuff for that. He did it so quickly as well. I know, literally. He was in and out. I thought it'd be like all day or something. No, but... no, in and out. Right, well worth it, isn't it? Yeah. Because that would have took me... Well, I'd have never got this finished, but... That would have took me... Weeks... Just to well, more back than that. Roughly, you know. If you not remember the big mantelpiece, this was done with an angle grinder, and it just wasn't ever yeah. brought up to scratch. Cool. Thumbs up. Good. Yes. Are you after something in particular? This maybe? She's a proud mum out with her babies. How are they doing, Mum? How many have you got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Bless them. Right. I'll get you some chick food. Hi. 
Hi all, Hi we just Anna. wanted to say that since our last video, we've now been monetized on YouTube. So thank you everyone for that because it's everyone that subscribed and watched the videos that's made that happen for us. So that's really great. Ama literally amazing. I cannot thank everyone enough for your love and your support and your comments and just everything. Yeah, I mean, I think the comments are just so amazing, aren't they? Just uh, reading that, yeah. that many people that like what we're doing and just our family and our friends are just overwhelmed by the kindness and just everything that everyone is saying and yeah it's just so overwhelming you know like all the love and the support that we've had from everybody it's it's just yeah I just can't believe it it's just, yeah. the, oh, just thank you just thank you so much so thank you and we'll see you next week and if anyone knows of a decent hairdresser so i could get my hair cut before next week's video then <laughs> Please put that in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Bye.